Hey everyone, it's Ultraviolent4 here. Welcome back to part 3 of Octopode Fighter. We're just about to enter Lair. It's unfortunately a little bit earlier than I would have liked to come in. I wanted to do level 10 of the dungeon first, but we had a little bit of trouble there. There was Fanar, the unique, and then we were fairly close to dying to an unseen horror. So I would have liked to have been able to find some sort of poison resistance maybe, but we haven't been lucky enough to find any rings that are too exciting, which when you're an octopode who's able to wear eight rings, that's kind of what you want to do. Have a whole bunch of slaying rings and AC rings and you name it. Not to be, at least not for the moment. So we're going to dip into lair. The sort of long-term game plan here is that I'm training my trident to min delay, training my shield to 15 to get rid of the penalty, and then, uh, well there's our one spell, that kind of says it all, uh, but we have we have a few summoning spells here, and that's the direction that I'm going to head in. I've also noticed that I'm at 4 piety, which gives me the ability for idealize, so if we have a look at that, makes your ancestor an idyllic version of their best self so it heals them back to full and it makes them uh, here you go dramatic increase in strength, spell casting and armor quality healing and duration is based on your invocation skill so that's a nice ability to have but you can see we have 63% failure at the moment and seeing as its power is based on their invocations it's going to be pretty much useless until we train some. Here we go. Nothing to... Uh, I don't want to ID that. Hey, there's a ring. We have removed curse. Is this the slay ring? No. No, it's not. Uh, man can dream, right? Apparently not. You can see already how much uh, damage we took from just the poison of that one Macassan. Okay, and we learnt last episode how much damage Yaks can do to a... <laughs> can you help me with this one, Demise? Thank you. Uh, and I'm going to need you to kill the Spiny Frog. Get the Spiny Frog. It's been drained and slowed. Still potentially going to do a lot of damage to us. Help me out. Help me out. Uh, there's now a Ren Gargoyle, so we need to leave. And... Ow. I need to get Demise back. Alright. Well, that was a kind of disastrous start to lair. <laughs> uh, oh, some. That's just a zombie, that's right. I thought it was a wolf pack. Um, spiny toads are going to be really dangerous to us. We have no poison resistance and we have no AC. So they're really scary. And then to have it at the same time as some yaks and a random gargoyle in lair uh, is not, not the start we're after. Uh, and that's not the start of that fight we're after. I'm going to... Just, yeah. Just let Demise die. And then reset that fight. Don't want to start it just eating a stone arrow. Uh, the Gaga was hard enough on its own that from full health uh, it's a challenge. Don't need to start off at a disadvantage. Dodging to 8. And I should wait for Demise, there we go, before we go after this gargoyle. From memory, yeah, we've used all of our uh, heal wounds. In a pinch against a spiny toad, a lignification should help us. Gives us the poison resistance as well as extra AC. There it is. Um, I'm going to yell him over. And then 
We'll wait. Okay, here we go. Oh man, okay, so Demise just got wrecked. And then the gargoyle immediately uh, random energy us. That's alright. Uh, okay, here's a null sergeant. Has a spear of flaming. We could, assuming we kill him, we can test this out. Uh, okay, so we're getting surrounded by nulls. Uh, not ideal. Okay, good. Uh, we may as well test the spear of flaming because it might be plus nine. It's plus one, so it's not, it's not worth it. The plus one trident is better. The little bit of extra damage you get for flaming is not worth uh, the what's gonna call it the base damage of a trident. Uh, this is scary. I should not be taking any more hits of those. There we go. All right. So we know there's a spiny toad here, a spiny frog. Uh, it immediately gets trained, which is good. Now if we just get hexed, there we go. Thank you. Good job, Demise. Knew you'd come through in the end. Alright. Uh, we can probably one-on-one -on -one, one of them. I'm just tapping this slowly because the Yak is liable to just max damage us with no AC. And then we'll be in trouble. Uh, let's not die to an Oclob either. Okay, a uh, bunch of rats. Well, we can fight all this stuff probably. Maybe not. Yeah, okay. Demise down. Let's head back over. Are they fast? I don't think so, right? It is fast, okay. Today I learnt. So, uh, what about the other rats? No, it's just these hell rats are fast. Okay. Alright, so we can walk away from this one. Okay, yeah, Demise is back. I wondered why. It seemed like, uh, okay, there's a Hydra. As we were walking away, that uh, rat was getting a lot of free hits on us. All right, so this is unfortunate because we're on layer one. So if I run away from this and just run straight back up the stairs, uh, the Hydra is gonna be sitting there. So the next time I come down, it can just one shot kill us. So what am I gonna do here? If I disintegrate it, it's like a 30% chance. I think my best bet is just to uh, kind of cut it around a bit and maybe hope that Demise can hex it. Maybe I could even try and idealize. It seems like something that's never going to work. Yeah, and Demise is never going to kill it. Do we just... Okay, it looks like we kind of just stealthed away from it. So we'll try to ugh, try to avoid that hydra. Right, we should go get that crocodile because we don't want enemies camping out at the exit stairs. If we're running away from something, like we were from those rats or even a hydra, we don't want to meet a crocodile while we're on low HP. Right, I'm kind of thinking that if I see a downstairs, is that a normal one? No, that's a hatch. If I see a normal downstairs somewhere, I think I might just take it. And then uh, we can deal with the Hydra Menace when we have uh, Lightning Spire and the like. Taking this slowly. Okay, uh, more spiny frogs.
Alright, that one's seen us. I'm gonna start backing away. I'll tell Demise. Okay, Demise confused it. Thank you. There's another one. As long as... Oh dear. Alright, I think we got it. Um, as long as it's just one spiny frog at a time, that's probably okay. The danger is going to be if we fight something and then we're kind of low and then a spiny frog turns up because they're fast as well. Maybe we should ID this wand as kind of like a how do we kill Hydra's tech. It's not a very good tech though because they have good MR. So you have to beat their MR to try to disintegrate them, which probably needs quite a few hits to kill them anyway. So what if we... Spy is 100%. Thinking maybe... No, I don't want to just rush Spy. I mean, I kind of do, but... I'd also like to get my shields and polearms to their respective levels. No, I think we'll just... We'll keep going on this plan. We'll get our weapon and shield skill going, and then we'll... Once we're there, and once we start going into summonings, we'll be pretty strong. So there's this kind of intermediate period here where we're still kind of weak and fragile. But as long as we uh, take it easy, we should be able to uh, make it through with our ancestor. As long as we don't uh, end up fighting too many things at once. Or get stuck fighting crazy unique or a hydra like this. Because what's our percent chance to disintegrate? Yeah, 30%. It's really not that good. Um, well, I could try. Yeah. That one hit. What if I... He drained it. The thing is, the Hydra could foreseeably one-shot us. Uh, it has five heads. I think each head can do 18 damage. Yeah, 18 per head. So, if they all did max damage, not even all, if most of them did max damage and we didn't block or dodge any, we could one shot die to it. I don't know. I feel like Demise is trying to hex it, but I feel like that's never going to work. Okay, there's the spiny frog. Okay, I'm thinking I just want to go down these stairs. Hopefully, okay, no new Hydra, just right there. Uh, there's a, a spider vault over there, though. That's dangerous. Uh, I can see a jumping spider. Uh, so I want to stay away from that. Again, I don't have our poison. So if it's uh, like a jumping spider and then some red backs and stuff, uh, that would be really bad. Uh, this is kind of bad, too, because we don't have our... Um, we don't have our ancestor with us. Maybe I could just try some disintegrations. Okay. I'm, so I'm constricting the water macassan, which means uh, every turn while it's constricted, I'll deal damage to it. So I'm constricting that one. I know I have guaranteed damage every turn, and I'm hitting the hippogriff with my auto attack. And so I'm killing both of them. Okay, so we've got our ancestor back. That's good. And then uh, we don't have an ID for this new potion. That's okay. All right. Uh, and I want to X this out, actually. I don't want to go anywhere near the spider vault just yet. Okay. Is this our, our requirement? We still have requirement, brand weapon, silence, summoning, torment, vulnerability. Let's go requirement. No, it was summoning. So that's a waste. Whoops. Oh well. Is this a swamp? Oh, maybe. Okay, there's another stair up. Uh, although we'll lose all our summons, so let's uh, just chill out a bit. We've got a blinking scroll, and this book is a book of cantrips. 
which has appetition and it has animate skeleton. Uh, I feel like we should learn animate skeleton because uh, this is difficult enough that um, it's difficult enough that I should bother with the tedium. And I'm going to learn appetition as well, although I'm not training those. Uh, so I got 50% on animate skeleton, which is fine because um, you can just keep having goes at it, it doesn't really matter. And I want to make. Oh, that is fine. Now I'll make a macro though. Uh, this one? Yeah, okay, I've already got the macro. Okay. So I'm going to go back up the stair. Okay. Uh, well, maybe I can grab that book there. No, I can't because the hydra is guarding it. Oh, let's X this one out too. Okay, and then once we're past this hump that I've been talking about and we've got our summons and everything going, then I probably won't bother with Animate Skeleton. But for the meantime, it will be um, quite a spike in power. Okay, well it just timed out before we uh, got to do anything with it, but that's okay. More TP. And there's a hill winds. Let's XV our this basilisk. So it has a 40% chance to petrify us. So what I'm gonna do is maybe get a stab. Okay, so we immediately got petrified. I was gonna say we can maybe stab it and then um, just step behind our our dude. Alright, so what I wanna do here. The danger is that if I get petrified, this crocodile can just kill us. I think I need to read a fear. So I kind of, I kind of messed up by going for the greedy stab when the uh, correct play would have been to just um, yell to wake it up and then stand behind my ancestor so that it didn't have the chance to. Uh, What's gonna call it? Petrify me at all? Uh, Spiny frog. So I'm just kind of sitting behind all my dudes. Shields to eleven. We're getting closer. Uh, there's a jumping spider. I'm just gonna call them at me while I've got these ancestors and skeletons to help me out. They have a yeah, see, there's the red back. Yeah, and you see how much damage this does. Like, I just immediately am nearly dead. Um, it's a good fear again, but we could potentially just die. I think I need a blink. This is really crappy. Hmm. Yeah, I think I need a blink. I just, oh, there's a, a red back around this side. So I'm going to fear. And then I need my ancestor so I don't just die to this jumping spider. And where are we going? Uh, we don't have any good upstairs we can go up. So this is kind of, I guess we want to just head up. Game is hard. Get him. Okay, he's confused. They have pretty low MR, so again, if I can fight them one on one, um, Demise should be able to confuse them fairly successfully. Okay, good. Uh, we want more int. And again. Confuse it, please. It's slowed. But the confuse would be. There we go. 
That's what we're after. All right. So we know there are red bats around. Um, similar thing though. One at a time they have low MR, Demise can hex them. But um, if they all come at us at once, they're fast. They do a lot of poison damage. And we are very fragile. Another ID. Uh, teleport. We're really running through our um, escape options though. So we've, we, we've lost all our fear now. Uh, we use that blinking we had. We still have one heal wins. And four haste. I, sh I should remember that. I still have plenty of haste. That's an elephant. I don't know that I'm ready to fight an elephant pack. Probably we can fight one, maybe. Okay. What? It was drain and it was briefly confused. Uh, okay. Okay, we finally got that one. Okay. I feel like the drain helps quite a lot. Okay. I'm really on edge right now. <laughs> this game is hard. Why didn't I know? There's no point doing spire. What else have I got? Habitation does nothing anyway. Um, I could learn some of these smaller summons. Call imp maybe. No, it's just not worth it. If I'm gonna train summoning, I may as well just train for spire. The time can't come soon enough though. Maybe we're doing a... Okay, we're doing a tech change. This is too hard. I'm gonna leave shields on, but I'm also gonna go summonings and air magic. And let's get Spire going. We're kind of relying on Demise to um, hex things before we fight them with our trident anyway. So... I guess the Mindalay can wait. Please kill this one. Good. I can't animate spiders, of course. Alright, let's auto explore. I think we've got all the jumping spiders. Yeah, it's just the red backs now. Yeah, and see, they get confused. They're pretty easy to be hexed. And there's two at once though. Okay, get this one. Uh, okay, this is bad. We're gonna need to, I think, lignification. So that will give us extra AC and poison resist. Cause they're gonna they're gonna poison me so much just normally, and I'm just gonna get shredded with no AC. Oh, there's a hydra. I'm glad the the form ran out before he got to us. Oh, I thought it confused. I thought uh, Demise confused it. Wonder Flame just does nothing. That does nothing either. So what do we do? We run it all the way around. We haven't found an upstairs that we actually can use. It must be somewhere over there. Uh, okay, well I guess we just have to run the Hydra around for a bit. I don't want to go near the water because the Hydra will speed up in water and catch me. Um, I'm amphibious, so I don't get slowed in water, but I also don't go faster. And hopefully there's no like other Hydra over here somewhere. I'm just going to bring him back to me. I'll bring it, because I'm forgetting, of course, that Demise is a... Uh, non-binary gender fluid ancestor. And I kind of hope it's forgotten me. Okay, there's the other upstairs. Uh, let's get rid of this one. 
and hope that this stair isn't okay really dangerous it's not should wait for yeah there we go all right so that's the the one stair we can use to come back up maybe we can uh, get that book now <laughs> Doubtful. Let's see, I'm taking it slowly because I don't want to um, walk into a Hydra and get one shot. As we established, they can potentially do. What is this? A book of unlife that is um, simulacrum, death channel, animate dead. So this is kind of like we could go all in. We could go all in necromancy on this. Um, I think I'd rather stick towards the the summoning rather than the necromancy. So. Yeah, not going to go that, that route, although it would be possible. Wow, look at the damage. Uh, we'll drop the book. If you're too injured to use tab like that, like this, if I try to tab it won't let me you can press V to evoke your spit or your polar and then reach around. Let's keep waiting for the Hydra to turn up. Yeah, there we go. Called it. Um, well, we can go down any of these stairs. I'd rather not go down the one that had the other Hydra at it. So I'll pick this one. Okay. Alright. So I guess we've probably seen enough of this floor that we can go to layer 3. Alright. Spires to 99% progress. Another book. And a whole bunch of dudes at once. You can't fight a whole bunch of dudes at once. And we'd like to find uh, another stair up because uh, the Hydra is potentially sitting at that one. Seeing as it chased us to it. Okay, this one. Okay, good. Alright. So that's a safe stair up. Uh, a glowing hand crossbow. Ooh. This we can use with a shield, so. Plus two hand crossbow freezing. Uh, that's good. So we can drop the hunting sling. This is much better. And the sling bullets. And I guess the stones. And we can uh, pick up bolts. So I'm not going to train this. Um, at least not yet. Like maybe one day in the future we could train the hand crossbow. But uh, just to have uh, to shoot things at range is good although we have no bolts so we need to find some not that I'm going to do this because I'd have to go up past the hydras etc but if we find any bolts in there we can then start using the hand crossbow alright these, these enemies, packs of enemies are so fragile Book of Changes. Uh, they're kind of nice, but we're not an unarmed octopode. So I think it's a bit late to be a transmuter. Guess skeleton. And I think we can. Yeah, he makes snake skeletons. Okay, come on. Uh, 
Uh, this is kind of working, also kind of not. No, okay. We'll just take this one up. It looks like the others have lost interest in us. We can fight one. Okay, good. We want to get the mines back. Doing my best to sit behind all my allies. Um, okay, yeah, as long as we kill that one, this one's confused. The poison hurts so much. When we see black mambas, um, it's going to be a lot of trouble actually being so fragile and having no uh, poison hey ring is this the uh, poison? I didn't say no magical power okay that does very little for us at the moment spies to 97% we're getting there we're not Alright, we need to uh, try to string these yaks out a bit, split them up, rather than fight the whole pack at once. As is now about to happen. <laughs> Alright, no good. We can start fighting them here in the hallway. The problem is that summoning to three. Um, any of these can kind of just hit us for a very big chunk of our health. Which is why I'm tabbing quite slowly. I'm not just slamming the tab key. Uh, like that. I'll take one more hit. Okay, like that was the hit. Now we'll just wait for Demise to respawn. Or I could do this too. Uh, we miscast it. Okay, well this works. Yeah, part of the reason I wanted to stay there is because I had all these yak corpses there. So uh, by running away completely, I was running away from a whole yak army I could potentially have. Let's do this uh, degen. No good. Oh wow, see how much that hurts. Uh, I'm going to put on the ring of ice. Everyone get it. Get it. Okay, good. Remove the ring of ice. Goodbye, Yakami. Bread ration. Okay, another thing of yaks. As far as packs go, I can't be too unhappy with yaks. Thankfully, they're not packs of like blink frogs and stuff. Which I'm probably about to see now that I've just jinxed that. Alright, I have a mac macro for that. I keep forgetting. There's a. Uh, some sort of stuff. Could be wizardry. Yeah, it is. Good. Um, this one. I'm gonna put the hand crossbow on W. See so if I have wizardry on. My spire becomes 52%, so that means we're almost there. That's a really good find. And that looks like we just found shoals, which uh, would be the preferable one, actually. Because uh, for swamp, hydras are hard to hex, whereas merfolk are not. Uh, we're not bothered by the water in shoals like most characters would be. And also, we're likely to find demon tridents in shoals. So that would be very, very good for us as a shield and trident user. So we're happy about finding shoals over swamp. Is this our our poison? No, but we can remember to stay positive. Uh, that's not how you spell it. There you go. Just as a little reminder. Alright, 
Uh, I feel like this is an O'Club room. Yeah, it is. Uh, let's not die to that. That'd be embarrassing. Uh, so all that's left here is the... The Shoals Vault. Um, I don't remember what's in this one, but I feel like it's probably dangerous. So I'm just gonna go down to left floor. And we'll just remember that Shoals is on this floor. There's an, a random anaconda just in the dungeon. Or in lair. That seems... Uh, very curious. I think they have pretty high ammo. Let me just compare it to say an adder. Now it has... What does it say? 10 MR, which I think is normal. If I do an anaconda... They have 40 MR. Okay, so they are actually quite hard to hex. If I have a look with disintegration... No, they're actually not that bad. But still, I'd rather just not. I don't know why there's a random anaconda on there for. Um, there's an anaconda as part of a um, a difficult layer 6 ending, which is uh, much later than this random layer 4 one. Where are our downstairs? Oh, they're all in this. Wow, so we actually have no ability to... Uh, avoid this anaconda unless I want to try to kill the Oclobs. Alright, looks like we're going back to D10. Uh, we need to get Spire up before we... Uh, before we try to fight that anaconda for sure. Alright, so this game's really hard. I mean, I can't... I can't pretend that I'm surprised because it's melee octopode. But still, uh, there's, there's all my blink frogs I was just talking about. Uh, this is really bad. Help me out. I just wanna... Okay. I think Demise is dead. Yep. Yeah. Got air magic to... 4. Okay, we got that one. Yeah, they hurt so much. We have a lot of teleport. I mean, are two blink, blink frogs really going to kill us? They might, but it doesn't look like it. Uh, how much damage can a blink frog do? Up to 20. Is that... Yeah, okay, so it can do 20 damage, so I can take one more hit. Good. Man, this game's hard. <laughs> Alright, so we were going not at that stair. That stair. Uh, okay, well there's that Hydra. Um, maybe we could try to exploit it, but we're just going to die. <laughs> Man. Oh, there's a slow. We can kind of kite it now. And a drain. I think we're doing it. I think we're doing it. Demise went down, but we, we got it. We got that Hydra. So, uh, let's clear the, the ones on the upstairs. Okay. And then one of these should be a Hydra Stair. This one is not? No, it might be. So I feel like the Hydra's at all the stairs on this floor. What about this one? No, okay, it wasn't there last time we were there. So let's try this one. Okay, good. Um, why are we not... Okay, auto pickup is on. Let's pick up some bolts. Now we have some... Now we have the ability to hand crossbow free stuff. And let's can we get out of here? Back into the dungeon. Ok, 
Here we can. Our Spire is at 43%. So we'll be there soon. Once we get Spire, we can kill Hydras and layer stuff fine. So we want to go down to D10. Although, um, we can check if there are bolts around. There's some on D7 and D6. So we'll go grab those. A wyvern and skeleton. Man, does so much damage. Life is hard when you have one AC. Oh yeah, here's that ghost. We can probably fight it now. There's a siren. The Wand of Digging, I'm not in a hurry to buy that. If anything, I'd rather have the File of Floods. And I think there's one more set of bolts. Yep, on D6. Okay, some nulls. Alright, so we got all our bolts. Let's go back to D10. Where uh, we know there's an Unseen Horror somewhere on the floor. But, uh, we're probably a bit stronger now. And Demise the Hexa can, uh, see in Viz and maybe kill it. Can, maybe. We can also have some, uh, skeleton allies. Okay. Demise got wrecked by that orc. They have low MR, so they should be fairly hexable. Ah, uh, there's some bees. Uh, that's really bad for someone with no AC and no poison resistance. But thankfully they're easy to hex. Alright, let's try again. Ah, uh, there's Fanor. We, we want the Ring of Ice. And am I just going to get wrecked here? I could might if need be. Get him. I feel like this could this fight could go so badly so quickly. Yeah. I mean it was kinda working and then he uh kinda tricked us by swapping with his summons. He used my own strat against me. What a jerk. Alright. Help me out, Demise. It's okay. I'm just constricting him. Okay, we did it. Ah, uh, jeez. I don't want to fight that orc warrior. What was I doing? Uh, there's some... Another ring of ice and a blue potion. May as well. Hex him. There we go. And magic to five. That makes us 32%. So we are getting there. It is a struggle. Recharging another might. We've actually got auto pickup off. Let's put it back on. And where is this unseen horror? I know it's somewhere. We want to be in a hallway. Though that would be the best way to do it so that Demise sucks the Hexa can just kill it for us uh, there's a priest, I'll let it come to us animate it again The plain orc guys are not really threatening. So I don't mind just hitting them with my spear rather than worrying about trying to get behind my ancestor. That is 22%. Alright, we're nearly there. Have I found orc? I have not. 
I was just thinking if maybe uh, I wanted to head back into head into a bit of orc rather than trying to face an anaconda, even with spire. But uh, we haven't found orc, so that's not even a possibility. Uh, bees again. Oh boy. Uh, okay. Oops, I hit the wrong one. If I get... Okay. It's gonna say if they all start smiting me there. Could die. It sounds like there's some sort of serious criminal activity going on at the moment. Because there's a lot of what I assume is police sirens. If I just do a glance around my my place, it doesn't look like it's on fire, so that's okay. Alright, there's our D10. Our uh, spy is now 22%, so we might do our D11, I think. but. You'll have to wait for the next one. So join me in the next one where we see if we can actually make some progress in this game. Because at the moment, it is really hard. Alright, see you all later.